Al Cadillo back again, and now we're going to show you how to import your files and get set up in Premiere Pro CC for editing. We've opened up Premiere Pro CC already, and now we're going to create some folders to keep everything organized. We've got footage, sequences, logos, music, and you may want to add more or less, but these are the ones that I always start out with. The next thing we're going to do is we've got two different ways to import the files, either by using the media browser, Select the files that you want to use from the Adobe Media Browser, and then drag them to the footage folder that you created. An alternate method is to open the File Explorer on Windows, or, if you're on a Mac, use Mac Finder, and then drag and drop the selected files into the footage folder. From there, grab your selected files and drag them to the new item icon. This will create a new sequence using the properties from the files that you imported. Let's take the sequence in that file list and move it into the sequence folder to stay organized. But now you're ready to edit. These files may look a little different than you're used to. They are presented to you as equirectangular. 360 and VR180 video are both spherical videos. But in order for you to edit these videos, they are presented as 2D equirectangular, which is to say that they are cut apart and laid out flat so you can see them easily for editing. That's all there is to it. Please subscribe to my channel, and if you have any questions, please put them in the comments section below.